as uh, an important um, element of the internet governance regime. And uh, because it is coming up for renewal, um, it is something that we should be discussing in this session. It would be nice to actually discuss a real governance issue in this session. Um, I would like to make a few comments about that, starting with uh, what I thought were very helpful observations uh, from Bertrand. Uh, I agree with him that the issue is the integrity and functionality of the Internet's uh, root. Uh, and that is the criteria against which any institutional changes should be held up against. So I agree that governments who complain about U.S. unilateral control have a burden to explain how any alternative institutional arrangement would improve things with respect to the functioning of the Internet. I would remind Bertrand and everyone else that it's not just the domain name route that we're talking about, however, it's also the address, addressing hierarchy route, and that this is uh, an increasingly important element of Internet governance. Um, some people have talked about the separation of functions that are currently bundled in the IANA contract as an element of uh, uh, governance that could be changed or reformed in the process of moving forward. So, for example, the IANA contract could be separated into a standards component uh, going to the IETF, an addressing component going to somebody and the domain name component it doesn't necessarily have to be bundled in one organization. And that brings me to my last point, which has to do with the role of the IANA contract in, as an accountability mechanism, uh, that if you simply assume or give this contract to one organization, ICANN, uh, which has weak accountability things, uh, weak accountability mechanisms already, uh, the IANA contract renewal could be a good way to uh, ensure uh, that it is more accountable uh, by making it renewable and competitively bid over a period of, uh, let's say, five to ten years. Thank you. May I just ask back, Milton, you sat in the... I would say unusual, uh, careful way uh, that some people suggest to split these functions. Do you think they should be split? There are advantages and disadvantages that need to be discussed carefully about that. Uh, the, the advantage is the decentralization of authority, uh, and there are very few, very few technical interdependencies. There, there are some, but very few technical interdependencies between the address and the domain name root administration. So why do they have to be together? Um, and so the advantage is the decentralization of power. The disadvantage is that you might have to create another policy forum and, and duplicate the costs of uh, people uh, running around uh, talking about these things. Milton, I, uh, thank you. I just want to make it really clear to everybody in this room that, um, that there's no close down on this. If, you want to, if people want to talk about um, you know, IANA contract, that's absolutely fine.